point in the training where I talked to you, um, thinking back to when I first started and uh, with Soul Collage. And um, every group is different. And, uh, and what I, I think I want to really share with you, just based on the conversations we've had um, over meals and um, some of the conversations I've been having with the new facilitators recently, um, as Kailia was saying yesterday, you know, soul collage is a really an opportunity for you to develop your own authenticity, your own idea of who you are, and really, really discover and explore. Um, and part of being a facilitator is understanding what special gifts you bring to soul collage. And each one of you has something unique and special that you're bringing to this process. And it's not just what this process is bringing to you, it's what you're bringing to it. Uh, and, and in order to get there, um, you have this beautiful tool. It's called your deck. And some of you just have the beginnings of your deck. Um, some of you already have a fairly large deck. But that's your way of going inside and really finding what are my special gifts? Mm -hmm. Who am I? What's the authentic self that brought me to this workshop this weekend? And, and it's not just about what I want to do with other people, but, but what is this calling in me? What is this about in my own personal growth, in my own journey? And this journey that you're taking isn't just in my opinion, it isn't just for this lifetime. I mean, this is soul growth. This is really growth that's building uh, you. It's building uh, growth and healing for your family, for those that have come before you, and those that have, will come after you. I mean, this reverberates all throughout. And in order to do that, you really can use your deck to do some really deep inner work. And from my own personal experience, uh, I found soul collage because art was my way of healing. I'm a trauma survivor, and I used art to find out what was going on inside of me, and that's why I became an art therapist. So when I found Sina's book, I already knew that you know this is all about my process. This is all about how I have been healing with art, but she's given me this beautiful structure, which I didn't have, this container. Uh, and she's showing me how I can tap into some of these scary places inside of me. Let them be seen, let them be heard, let them be witnessed. You aren't just witnessing other people, you're witnessing yourself, and you're witnessing those parts of you that have been afraid to show themselves. And you know it's a it's an it's it's a it's a special tribute to this group that those really shy, scared parts of you showed up last night, and they've been showing up all weekend, and they'll continue to show up when you go home. And what I have told several of you is, you don't have to go in there alone. You have resources in me and. You know, see that, and you know, and, and a lot of soul collage facilitators and trainers who understand the process, but who also understand how to take you into those dark, scary places. Uh, I don't go there alone. I've been doing uh, personal work with my dad continuously with someone else um, because I know there's still so much in there that wants me to uh, see it, and I'm learning how to. Um, get the different conflicting parts to work together, to comfort each other. I'm learning that these are energies that are, that this isn't just a box or a quit things. This is like an alchemical container. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Stuff happens in there. <laughs> <laughs> and if I'm not paying attention, I don't know if anybody read like the Indian in the cupboard to their kids, you know. <laughs> put this little toy in the cupboard and all these things start happening. <laughs> um, that, that happens. These, these cards are expressions of energies and they don't, um, they, they don't die when you make them. They come alive. Mm -hmm. They come alive. Mm -hmm. And they're energies that are in your body. So if you're not working with them, they're just kind of sitting there in your body. 
like, okay, okay, we're waiting, we're waiting. And if they don't get attention, they can start making you feel sick. You know, so keep working with these energies, allow them, they can change, they can <coughs> shift, they can start working with each other, they can find uh, parts in your deck that can be helpful to them. They can be, you can have bullies in your deck that are bullying parts of you. You know, if that's going on, you wanna, you wanna see that, you wanna know. Um, and you don't have to do it alone. And in fact, I would encourage you to find someone, someone who understands the process and maybe somebody in your community and some of you are lucky enough to be in areas where there are lots of people who know the process and who are used to working in therapeutic setting. Um, how, or do it with a friend. Some of you came with friends, you know, do group readings in groups. But find a way that, because it is a community process, <coughs> um, you have somebody to help you go into those places where you can really pull up those gifts that are just waiting to be expressed. And finding your authentic brand of soul clash and your authentic brand of you and bringing that to the process. This is deep personal inner work and when you do your work, it shows, people recognize it and they want that. That's the, that's the I want what she's having. <laughs> and, and they don't even know that that's what they're seeing. You know, it's my experience. I think what we all want um, really um, is to be seen and the part of us that wants to be seen is the part of us that we're not seeing ourselves, mm -hmm. you know, often. Mm -hmm. So um, that's your challenge. Just so <laughs> go home with your deck and really start working, seeing what's going on. Um, I love nothing more than taking somebody's deck and spreading it out on the floor, mm. the whole deck, and just seeing what's going on. Yeah. Okay. You know, where, where are the repeated elements? Um, you know, who's on top of whom? Who's who's trying to cover up somebody? You know, who, which archetypes are bossing the committee members? <laughs> 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 Things like that. Are there workshops like that? Yeah, I, I, very good segue. <laughs> 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 